Welcome to Jira Squad. Welcome back to our channel. It's Jin and Rel, and today we're going to be checking out The Godfather. To see the full version of this reaction, check out our Patreon. The link is in the description below. Also, shout out to our top tier patrons. We appreciate you guys so much. And guys, remember, once you join our Patreon, you'll need to line up your copies of the movie with our reactions. Make sure you smash that like button, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Now let's get right into it, guys. Mario Puzo's The Godfather. And I raised my daughter in the American fashion. I gave her freedom, but I taught her never to dishonor her family. She found a boyfriend, not an Italian. Two months ago, he took her for a drive with another boyfriend. Mm -hmm. Oh, like his friend? And then they tried to take advantage of her. Oh, damn. She resisted. Is she okay? So they beat her. Like an oh animal. Oh my gosh. Oh no, yo. Her job was shattered. Held together by wire. Why did the they hell? do that, yo? She couldn't even weep because of the pain. Oh no. That's horrible. But I wept. Why did I weep? Because that's your daughter. She was the life of my life. I wish she would never be beautiful again. Oh no. Yo. That's terrible. What's wrong with that boyfriend? Like, yeah. if she didn't want to go with another guy, like, what? I went to the police, like a good American. You went to the police? These two boys were brought to trial. They got away. The judge sentenced them to three years in prison oh, but... and suspend the sentence. What? They went free that very yeah. day. What? So they, they didn't even serve time? We must go to Don Corleone. Oh. oh. He wants them dead. Whoa. Look at that face. So who is this? This is obviously the Don. It says Don when he was talking and the subtitles oh. came out. Oh, cannot do. He Something. said he cannot do it. We've known each other many years, but this is the first time he ever came to me for counsel for help. Wow, that's the so first that's time. that's why you should do Can't it. I remember the last time that you invited me to your house for a cup of coffee. Oh, what? No. Well, that's a problem. You never wanted my friendship. This is bad for him. You were afraid to be in my debt. I didn't want to get into trouble. So he wasn't involved with him in that way. Mm -hmm. He was being normal, like a normal American, like he said. Yeah. Now you come to me and you say, Don Corleone, give me justice. You don't oh. even think to call me Godfather. Instead, you come into my house on the day my daughter's to be married and you ask me to do murder. Like I'm going to suffer then. She suffers. He's really trying. Mm -hmm. How much shall I pay you? What have I ever done to make you treat me so disrespectfully? I to offer money? Yes. You come to me in friendship. It's... And the scum that ruined your daughter would be suffering this in very friendship. day. friendship. See, you didn't invite him and for coffee. And by chance an honest man like yourself should make enemies, then he would become my enemies. I understand what he's saying. And then they will fear you. I guess he messed up. <laughs> Be my friend. Oh my god. It's too late. Yeah. This is it. And you were offering money still. Mm. Good. He okay. said good. Is he going to end him? Someday. And that day may never come. I'll call upon you to do a service. Oh shit. This is what he was afraid of. Accept this justice as a gift on my daughter's wedding day. Wow. Grazie. Yes, Grazie. So that's all you had to say. Yeah, you just had to say, I'm your friend. I'm a reliable people, people that aren't going to be carried away. I mean, we're not murderers, but in spite oh. of what this undertaker says. Okay. We're not taking the picture without Michael. What's the matter? Who said that? It's Michael. So He's he waiting didn't, on Michael. He didn't bother to take the picture? No. So, where's Michael then? Oh, he just arrived and... Okay. We don't even know if that's Michael. <laughs> it must Let's be. wait. Let's <laughs> wait. <laughs> oh no, that's it seems that's someone else for real. Taking the license plates? Yeah. I'm so glad we're watching this. I've never even seen a clip of this movie. Same, like I really like, don't know. I've never this seen is. anything. No quotes, no clips. Twenty thirty grand. And small bills, cash. He wasn't supposed to take any pictures. Did you see what that? The hell? He took it out. 
Yeah, he's not supposed to take any pictures of those people. Of them being there. Yeah. Those are other Dons, right? Because it looks like it. I saw him greet uh, Don Carleone okay. when he came and he kissed him on the cheek, I think. Don Carleone, I am honored and grateful that you have invited me to your home. He's practicing? Private party, go on. Hey, it's my sister's wedding. Damn. I guess they're God the police. Damn FBI, I don't respect nothing. FBI. That's why they're here snooping around. Yeah. <laughs> I was wondering what they're doing. That's why this guy was taking pictures. Yeah. As a real my friend, what can I do for you? Not that the war is over. This boy Enzo, they want to repatriate him back to Italy. Godfather, I have a daughter. See, she and Enzo. You want Enzo to stay in this country and you want your daughter to be married. You understand everything. <laughs> Wait till you see the beautiful wedding cake I made for your daughter. Oof, like this. He has a lot of friends. Who should I give this job to? To a Jew congressman in another district. Wow, they have links. They have the connections. Of course they do. Oh, this is Michael. Oh, he's in the army. He didn't expect to be invited to the wedding, so he wanted to thank you. Oh, this is the guy. He was practicing like he said. He was sitting there this whole time saying it over and over. His name is Luca Brasi. He helps my father out sometimes. Hmm. Your father's been asking for you. Very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. If he's your brother, why does he have a different name? My brother Sonny was a kid. He found Tom Hagen in the street and he had no home. And so my father took him in and he's been with us ever since. Wow. Oh, I see. He's a good lawyer. Oh. Not a Sicilian. I think he's going to be consigliere. What's that? Like a counselor, an advisor. Very important to the family. Don Colleone. I am honored. He's finally saying it to him. That you have invited me to your daughter's wedding. Oh. <laughs> On the day of your daughter's wedding. Oh, no. He's so nervous. Thank you, Luca. My most valued friend. Don Colleone. I'm going to leave you now because I know you are busy. Didn't expect wow. to be invited. He did He's it. honored. Yeah, he did it. Oh, okay. Don Carleon said thank you. I don't know. I like the respects they have for each other. Yeah, you can see that people has a lot of respect and I'm sure also fear. Yeah. So. It's the FBI showing up for me <laughs> to your, wed your daughter's wedding. I don't know what this is saying. <laughs> because they're singing in Italian. Yeah. They could have put the lyrics, you know. <laughs> Seems like a fun song, though. Yeah. Senator Cole, he apologized for not coming personally. He mm -hmm. said you'd understand. Also, some of the judges, they've all sent gifts. <laughs> what is that bad sign? Oh, I thought something bad was happening. Is he a celebrity or something? Yeah. Let's see. I guess they're friends. If you're all the way from California to come to the way I told you it was going to be. In two years, he's probably in trouble again. He's a good guy, son. Johnny! Johnny! Ganda na ganzo! Sing a song! Why do they love Johnny so much? Because he's a singer, it seems. That's why she's saying sing a song. Oh. My father helped him with his career. Wow. Oh. He did? He offered him ten thousand dollars to let Johnny go, but the band leader said no. Oh. So the next day, my father went to see him. Only this time with Luca Brazzi. Oh, Luca, yes. the one who was saying the thank you. Yes. For a certified check of one thousand dollars. He wasn't what? taking ten thousand dollars. And he set it for a thousand dollars. My father made him an offer he couldn't refuse. <laughs> wow. What was that? You his don't life. Know. Luca Brazzi held a gun to his yeah. head. <laughs> And my father assured him that either his brains or his signature would be on the contract. Yeah. Wow. That's a true story. <sighs> so that's how he got out of that contract. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's my family. It's unbelievable it's for me. her. It's not you? Oh, really? He said that's his family. Uh -huh. Not him. When he's talking about it so casually. Like, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't seem so hurt about it. 
Or like, oh no, that's what yeah. my dad does. <laughs> Is that Al Pacino? Who? The the son, Michael. He looks so different. I'm gonna have to take a good look. Yeah. My brother Fredo, this is Kay Adams. What? Hi. What's in her face? This man out there, he won't give it to me. The head of the studio. What's his name? Waltz. Waltz. He's got father. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. You can act like a man! What's the matter with you? <laughs> Is this how you turn around a Hollywood Pinocchio that uh, cries like a woman? Oh no, he goes. <laughs> what can I do? What can I do? He slapped him just now. That was unexpected. <laughs> he's like, really? He was being so calm the entire time. Yes, he was listening to him. That's really cool. Like when they're talking, he's just listening. But that slap though. Now he's wiping his tears? Yes. To the rest world in a month from now, this Hollywood Big Shot's going to give you what you want. Wow. That's awesome. I'm going to make him an offer he can't refuse. <laughs> Again? Right. <laughs> the Godfather takes care of everything. Yeah. Now, if there's nothing else, I'd like to go to my daughter's wedding. Yeah, he's been doing business this whole time. True. But yeah. They're finally taking the picture. Yep. She loves her dad. Yeah. Do you see the way she's hugging him? That's great. Time to make him an offer he cannot refuse. What favor would uh, your friend uh, grant, Mr. Wolf? You're gonna have some union problems. My client could make them disappear. Also, one of your top stars has just moved from uh, marijuana to heroin. Are you trying to muscle me? Absolutely no. not. Let me lay it on the line for you and your boss, whoever he is. Johnny Fontaine will never get that movie. Okay. I have a special practice. I handle one client. <laughs> now you have my number, I'll wait for your call. He doesn't know yet. He doesn't. Check him out. Okay. Why don't you say you work for Colleoni Tom? I thought you were just some cheap two-bit hustler Johnny was running in trying to bluff me. So he realized now that he he's like, why didn't you say it? Six hundred thousand mm -hmm. dollars on four hooks. I'll bet Russian Tsar's never paid that kind of dough for a single horse. Let's get something to eat, huh? <laughs> Look how friendly he's being now. Yep. Wow. Just tell him he should ask me anything else. But this is one favor I can't give him. Wow. wow. He's, he's not giving in. And I'm going to run him out of the business. Then let me tell you why. Johnny Fontaine ruined one of Waltz International's most valuable protégés. Oh. For five years, we had her under training, singing lessons, acting lessons, dancing what lessons. What did he do to her? Did he break her heart? Maybe. Or did he make her his wife? She was the greatest piece of ass I've ever had, and I've had them all over the world. Okay. So he took her from him? Then Johnny Fontaine comes along with his olive oil voice and Guinea charm. He took him. He took her. She runs off. With took, him? <laughs> yeah. She threw it all away just to make me look ridiculous. Oh, come on now. It's, it's not about you. I ain't no bad leader. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you heard the I story. I heard that story. Wow, that reaction. Corleone is a man who insists on hearing bad news immediately. Hearing bad news immediately. <sighs> um, what's with the blood? What? Why is he full of blood? He got shot? What is this? Oh my gosh. This is a nightmare. <gasps> it's the it's, horse! Oh my gosh. You shouldn't have said that it's about the horse, you know. He paid 600000 for it. And I think he loved that horse. He did. Well, I say yes. There's more money potential in narcotics than anything else we're looking at. Now, if we don't get into it, somebody else will. Maybe one of the five families, maybe all of them. Now, with the money they earn, they can buy more police and political power. Now, if we don't get a piece of that action, we risk everything we have. I mean, not now, but ten years from now. I need a man who has powerful friends. I need a million dollars in cash. I need Don Corleone, those politicians that you carry in your pocket. What is the interest for my family? Thirty percent. Why do I deserve this generosity? If you consider a million well, I guess dollars he's okay cash, with just thirty percent. It's crazy. I can, I can't really know what he's thinking <laughs> because he he always has the same face, the same look on his face, right? I must say no to you. See, see, no. And I'll give you my reasons. They wouldn't be friendly very long if they knew my business was drugs instead of gambling. Oh. 
But uh, your business is... Uh, it's going to be bad for his business. A little dangerous. Oh, are you telling me that the Talia's guarantee he, are Maybe invested? he wants him to raise the bar. That's my children, and I spoil them, as you can see. They talk when they should listen. <laughs> so he's not planning to join the narcotics then? Is that is that it, or is there a part? Or maybe because he's going to start it for himself. How? And he's saying their business doesn't conflict, but really? Doesn't it? Never tell anybody outside the family what you're thinking again. Wow. I noticed this nonsense from uh, Johnny starring in that new uh, film. Mm. <gasps> Johnny got the part. Make them think that uh, you're not too happy with our family. And, wow. And, uh, find out what you can. So he's going to investigate then mm -hmm. the other family that's involved with the narcotics guy. You? Yeah. I got something for your mother and for Sunny and a tie oh, for, yes, um, um, for Freddie and Tom Hicks. Is that right? Um, yeah. He's the guy from Scarface, right? Yes. I really need to watch that movie, like... You do. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to make you watch it. Yeah. I'll have to get it myself, Pa. Paulie called in sick this morning. Huh? The way you said, huh? He's like, called in sick? What? <laughs> I'm Bruno Tatalia. <laughs> I know. We procured the scotch. Free war. Don't say content to puke on La Familia Corleone. They're believing yeah. this too quickly. Yes, that was easy. He just showed up. He didn't even speak. As yeah. yet. And they said they heard he's not good with Don Corleone family. I guess it's on the streets. They put it out yeah. there. What did he see? What did he see just now? I don't even know. The way they were looking there. Oh, yeah. They're gonna kill him. Oh no. That's so sad, yo. So they knew. They, they knew it was a setup. They saw right through oh, that. Shoot. Come on, Luca just went to the wedding, yo. It's the end for Luca. Yo. Luca is dead now. Damn. And I thought they were believing. <laughs> they, of course, they were pretending, oh. man. I wanna talk. To no. You. I haven't got time. It's that same guy. Consigliere. Get in the car. No, Tom. If I wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already. That's not true. Okay. Well, it is true. <laughs> you could have tried, but you know Don Carleon would have retaliated. He's buying some fruits. Um, uh, me? What are you doing? They're trying to assassinate him, what? right? What the? Hmm. They caught him? Oh, shit. Damn, son, you took forever. Why did it take you so long to come out, oh, man? No. They got him good. Is he gonna die? What? They really got him. That's so messed up. <laughs> well, he is a bad man. Yeah, He's been well, doing he was, this to people a lot. So. But he was so nice to other people, to <laughs> so many people. <laughs> He brought so much value to his friends. I mean, Are they gonna try to get to the hospital? He's, he's just letting him bleed out. He's under what if he wasn't dead? He's dead. Like his son Michael is gonna hear about it. Oh, he's in the papers? Oh, Already? No. Gone down. Oh no. He had to find out this oh, way. He's dead or alive. Oh, yeah. They said feared, murdered. Like Maybe he's not dead. Yeah. Is he alright? He was just trying to get fruits. He wasn't just trying to get fruits alone. I mean, remember he was planning with Luca and stuff <laughs> to investigate those guys and to, you know. Yeah. <laughs> but he was doing dumb shit. Word is out in the street, he's already dead. What? No, what's the matter? Take it easy, take it easy. You want me sending people over here? No, 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 just you and him. Go ahead. That took a turn. Your boss is dead. Is he? It's not just his boss, it's his dad. Drink it. Um, I don't know. I wouldn't want to drink anything from you. He doesn't have a choice. You have to make the yeah. peace between me and Sonny. Okay. So you took their dad out and you want to make peace? Let's face it, Tom. I'm all due respect. 
The Don, rest in peace, was slipping. Okay, he was slipping? Ten years ago, could I have gotten to him? <laughs> so you gotta talk to Sonny. You gotta talk to the copper regimes, that Tessio, that fat Clemenza. First of all, it's not just Sonny. There's also Michael. Yeah. It's not Even Sonny wrong. won't be able to call okay. off Luca Brasi. Luca they Brazi. got Luca. It's also dead. You just talk to Sonny. And the other two kids. Their sister too? Michael, Michael and, and the sister. Mm -hmm. He's still yeah. alive. He's alive. They hit him with five shots and he's still alive. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah. It wasn't his time. Your mother's over in the hospital with your father. Looks like he's gonna pull through, thank God. If we lose the old man, we lose our political contacts and half our strength. Yeah. If your father dies, you make the deal, Sonny. You know, it's easy for you to say, Tom, he's not your father. I was as much a son to him as you or Mike. You want me to hang around? Yeah, hang around. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. <coughs> Some food in the icebox. You hungry or anything? No. Oh, that's the Polly guy that's sick. Mm -hmm. Polly sold out the old man, that struts. I don't want to see him again. Make that first thing on your list, understand? Understood. Oh, no. They're going to get rid of Polly. It's because they suspect that he's the one that sold out their dad. Yeah. Is, does this have something to do with Luca? Oh, what the hell is this? That's a Sicilian message. It means Luca Brasi sleeps with the fishes. Yes, what? they dumped him. I like the friendship he had with Don Carleone. The way he was practicing, that was yeah. so sweet. <laughs> yeah, we don't exterminate you. The way they're talking to Polly, and they're gonna get rid of him? Weren't they just laughing with Polly? <laughs> and they were instructed to get rid of him. Oh, damn. Yep. <sighs> what if he didn't do it? Ain't no friends in the game. You ain't learned that yet. <laughs> damn. If you're not family, but even family too. Like yeah. If you if you betray the family, yes. So. Right. It's over for you. You just have to be loyal. I love you. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I know. He's not gonna say it back. Mm -mm. I can't talk. Why you just spoke? You need to say it, Michael. What the? I'll see you tonight. He's not that type. Hey, come over here, kid. Learn something. You never know. You might have to cook for twenty guys someday. You start out with a little bit of oil, and you fry some garlic. Then you throw in some tomatoes, tomato paste. You fry it. You make sure it doesn't stick. A little bit of sugar. And that's my trick. Why don't you cut the crap? I got more important things for you to do. How's Paulie? Oh, Paulie won't see him no more. How's oh, Paulie <laughs> won't see him? Won't see him no more. Wow. And that's it. I have to go. Can I go with you? Go back to New Hampshire, and I'll call you at your parents' house. When will I see you again, Michael? I don't know. He has family business. Damn. She loves him. He wanted to stay in all that danger, girl. <laughs> <laughs> they can you anytime. Yeah. She wants to stay in the car and wait. What? They always get you in the car too. Yeah, <laughs> they always do. Like what? So it's, I'm not seeing anyone. Um, did they end his dad? Why didn't they have guys at the hospital? They probably did. It's crazy we're not going to see his dad's face. I mean, I liked his face. Yeah, I did. He just had one expression. <laughs> I loved it. There he is. So why is the hospital so empty? What are you doing here? You're not okay. supposed to be here now. I'm Michael Corleone. This is my father. What happened to the guards? Your father just had too many visitors. They interfered with hospital service. The police mm -hmm. made them leave about 10 minutes ago. That's not good. Um, that sounds kind of weird. Yeah. Listen, I got here late. There's nobody here. You and I are gonna move, move my father to another room. You know my father. Men are coming here to kill him. You understand? Now help me, please. They're really left, all of them. Yeah. That's kind of weird. I think they're really here to kill him. Like they are they coming to kill him. Who are you? I am Enzo, the baker. 
Yes, Enzo. You better get out of here, Enzo. There's going to be trouble. If there is trouble, I stay here to help you. For your father. For your father. Okay. But what if they, they'll end you? Wait for me outside in front of the hospital. All right? I'll be out in a minute. Why are you sending him out there? I don't know. He should leave. He came with flowers. Yes. It's really nice when your kids like you. It shows that, you know, you really were good to them. <laughs> He's smiling. He's so proud to see his son. He's so happy. Put your hand in your pocket like you have a gun. You'll be all right. This is so sad. You'll be okay. People mm -hmm. might pull up. But he really does want to stay for Don Corleone. He's sad. They're acting <laughs> like they have guns. Yeah. <laughs> Good. It would have been over if they started shooting, though. No? Yeah. <laughs> oh no. He's so shaken up. What? What is this? What are the cops doing? I guess searching them for guns because of those guys. I thought I got all you guinea hoods locked up. What the hell are you doing here? What happened to the men who were guarding my father, Captain? Why, you little punk? What the hell are you doing telling me my business? I pulled them guys off of here, huh? Now you get out of here and stay away from this hospital. Okay. It's clean, Captain. He's a war hero. He's never been God up damn it, I said take him in. What the hell? Yes, he's he's not even he's a war hero. Yes, he didn't do anything. He's not even a part of the mob. Stand him up straight. He's standing straight. <laughs> what the hell? Look at what they're doing to Michael. And he's clean. Attorney for the Corleone family. These men are private detectives hired to protect Vito Corleone. They're licensed to carry firearms. If you interfere, you'll have to appear before a judge in the morning and show cause. That was unnecessary. He was like, take him in. For what? For staying sta sta by his dad at the hospital? After the hospital thing, Sonny got mad. We hit Bruno Tattaglia at 4 o'clock this morning. What? Wow, it's so is he dead? Sonny is straight savage. <laughs> Look at his face. Beautiful. It's gorgeous. <laughs> it's swollen. He wants us to send Michael to hear the proposition. Bruno cancels out what they did to my father. So Sonny, we ought to hear what they have to say. Well, then business will have to suffer, all right? Hey, listen, do me a favor, Tom. No more advice on how to patch things up. Just help me win, please, all right? Now, nobody has ever gunned down a New York police captain, never. It would be disastrous. All the five families would come after you, Sonny. The Corleone family would be outcast. He's probably right. But he's been a problem. Somehow. Yes, but if they attack him, yeah, it, I know. it's going to be worse. Get our informers to find out where it's going to be held. They're going to search me when I first meet them, right? So I can't have a weapon on me then. But if Clemenza can figure a way to have a weapon planted there for him, then I'll kill them both. Wow. Michael is deciding to do business now. That's crazy what he said though. <laughs> Why are they laughing? That's a solid plan. It is? Yes. How is he going to kill them? You want to get mixed up in the family he business? He was a war Now hero. you want to gun down a police captain? Why? Because he slapped you in the face a little bit? You got to get up close like this. Bada bing! You blow their brains all over your nice Bada side. Bing. <laughs> a crooked cop who got mixed up in the rackets and got what was coming. That's a terrific story. And we have newspaper people on the payroll, don't we, Tom? It's strictly business. Yeah, that's how you do business. Everyone is going to gang up on them now. Yeah, I left it noisy. That way it scares any pain in the ass innocent bystanders away. Okay, it's loud for real. All right, you shot them both. Now what do you do? Run. Sit down, finish my dinner. What? What? Come on, kid, don't fool around. Just let your hands drop to your side. Now let the gun slip out. Everybody will still think you got it. You're going to be staring at your face, wife. So walk out of the place real fast, but you don't run. Okay. Don't look nobody directly in the eye, but you don't look away either. I hope it works out. <laughs> you do? <laughs> yeah, because why not? It's either these bad guys or the other bad guys. And I choose these bad guys. Yeah, because we know these guys. Yeah. They're my favorite bad guys. We don't know the other bad guys, so... You know, Mike, we was all proud of you being a hero and all. Your father, too. His face is getting looking bruised now. Yeah. Even so lots of people don't know where the meeting's gonna be held. Wow. 
How are they gonna do this? It's too much of a risk for Mike. Maybe we ought to call it off, Sonny. The negotiator keeps on playing cards until Mike comes back safe and sound. So why doesn't he just blast who's ever in the goddamn car? It's dangerous. <laughs> They'll be looking for that. So Lotso so might not even be in the car, Sonny. Louis' restaurant in the Bronx. It's perfect for us. A small family place, good food. Everyone minds his business. It's perfect. Pete, okay. They got an old-fashioned toilet. We might be able to take the gun behind it. You make them relax. Then you get up. This you is go so take risky. A mm -hmm. I mean, no, but it's still, they're also yes, kind of to with to Mike, right? And when you come back, you come out blasting. And don't take any chances. Two shots in the head apiece. I want somebody good, and I mean very good, to plant that gun. I don't want my brother coming out of that toilet with just his dick in his hands, all right? Damn. I'm thinking, obviously, those guys are planning to kill him, too. Yeah, definitely. How long do you think it'll be before I can come back? Mm. Look at his face. At least a year, maybe. Square with mom, you know, you're not seeing her before you leave. And uh, I get a message to that girlfriend when I think the time is right. Where is he gonna be the entire year after this? Just like chilling out, yeah, go on the road, and hiding. Damn, he's making a sacrifice. I'm glad you came, Mike. I hope we can straighten everything out. What if they decide to go to a different place? I mean, I hope you're not a hothead like your brother Sonny. You can't talk business with him. Sorry about the other night, Mike. I gotta frisk you, so turn around, huh? Can't stand the aggravation. You know how it is? <sighs> He's clean. How's it going to go? <laughs> and, I mean, they could have ended him in the car, right? But that's yeah. too risky. Nah, I think they want to do business for real. They want to make the deal. New Jersey? Where are they going? You know, New Jersey? Maybe. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Switched. Now they're going somewhere else. Nice work, Lou. Someone was tailing them? Maybe. So they're actually going to the place then. They're going back, right? They're actually going oh, to the restaurant. Yeah. It looks like he wants to, to kill you right now. Yeah. Like he's killed you a million times in his head. I'm gonna speak Italian to Mike. Go ahead. Oh. Where are we are we it? What the? Where's the subtitles? In They're not supposed to know what they're saying. So only if we like, only if we know Italian. Italian, <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Maybe they're talking about the police. What I want, what's most important to me, is that I have a guarantee. No more attempts on my father's life. What guarantees can I give you, Mike? I am the hunted one. All I want is a truce. How are you going to get a truce like that? That was a big no no. Yes. I have to go to the bathroom. Yeah, he does. I think he's it's had right. too much wine. You gotta go, you gotta go. Yeah, he needs to pee. I frisked him. He's clean. Don't take too long. Damn, is it gonna work out? Don't take too long for real. Is it there or did they. Mm. It's there. Oh my gosh. And it's loaded, right? Italian, come to padre. He just wants to shoot you in the face. You keep speaking. To padre. Please do it. <laughs> he keeps talking. He just wants to he just wants to off you. <laughs> okay. That's the neck. Twice. Twice. What? You only need one bullet in the head to die. No, but remember. What's his name? That guy, he said, do it twice. Put two bullets in their heads to make sure. He did it though. That guy kept talking and he kept speaking Italian and they weren't translated. <laughs> he had it coming. Yeah, he did. Shouldn't have punched him that night. What? Who's that smiling? That person's laughing. <laughs> what the hell? I don't know what that narcotics guy expected too. They let their guard down, right? Mm -hmm. They shouldn't have. That was a mistake. Well, the guy did say he's not clever, so. <laughs> I'm sorry, Fly doesn't know you yet. Right. Hey, big guy, give it to Grandpa. Okay. I hope you get wed, Grandpa, and I wish I would see you soon. Love you, grandson Frank. Oh, Frank. <laughs>
police have been cracking down on most of our operations. And also the other families. Of course. That's what he said that he said that was going to happen. I'm going to learn the casino business. Yeah. I knew he was going to ask. Michael will kill Salazzo. But he's safe. He's starting to work to bring him back. He didn't want that for him. Look at him with the notes and the... <laughs> <laughs> but Michael wanted to do it. Sorry, I want to say it's now, right now. Hey, Sonny, what? Things are starting to loosen up a little bit. If you go after the... I'm going to end it by killing that old bastard. I'm gonna yeah, you're getting a great reputation. I hope you're enjoying So they're not making any money then. Does she recognize him or something? Or... No, I think it's just love at first sight. Or... I was thinking. It's a shitty film and it's not going to work. Wow. More dangerous than shotguns. I'm not gonna feel contest with the Bruna. You Greg again, Dalia. Is it his daughter? No. He said no. The way he switched up just now. Get the sofigi. Yes. No, he said the sofigi. That's right. Okay, just that. No wonder he said that. I apologize if I offended you. She disappears as a love fish. I'm a stranger in this country. I'm an American. Hiding in Sicily. I'm going to send us to Sicily. My name is Michael Corleone. It's a llama Miguel Corleone. Well, there are people who pay a lot of money for that information. Ci sarebbe parecchia gente che pagherebbe per essere piccoli per informazione così. But then your daughter would lose a father. Ma allora vostra figlia perderebbe un padre. Instead of gaining a husband. I want to meet your daughter and under the supervision of your family. What's he going to say now? Mi chiamo Vitelli. He said he likes the way he talked. He likes what he heard. Well, I wonder if she's going to like him because she was looking at him. I guess she liked him immediately too, like love at first sight. With the with his girlfriend, he didn't say he he didn't tell her that he loves her back. So maybe he wasn't in love with her. Oh yeah, I forgot about her. You did? Yeah, I did. Oh, she's touching the necklace. She likes the necklace. She likes him very oh, much. Okay. I guess he didn't feel the love like she did. Like yeah. he didn't love her back. <laughs> the family is always there, all of them. <laughs> yes, he said that he's fine with them uh, being there, right? Well, that's good. It shows he respects her family. Yes. Wait, that's their sister? Huh? What's happening it's to her? Oh, shit. It was my fault! Where is Sonny, it? please, it was my fault. No. Sonny, it was my fault. I hit him. I started a fight with him. Please, Sonny. This makes no sense. He's gonna die. Why did he do that? Do it, Sonny. What's the matter with you? What, what, what kind of garbage what husband does she have? Before he's born. <laughs> if her dad knew about this. I don't think he could kill him, but he deserves a beating. Yeah. Because what? Oh. Like, take on someone your own size. Yeah. Why not fight? She's so tiny, too. Yeah, why not fight her brother? Then? Look at the way he did her face. Oh, his face is no match for him. Look at him biting. <laughs> He's running! <laughs> Take this. That's what you are, garbage. He's definitely not thinking straight. He's not. always getting married now. I hope nothing bad happens to her because now that he's in love with someone, they usually hit, hit you with that so that you can suffer. Like, get rid of your spouse. True. Is she a virgin? But we can we can never know because no. You should call. Oh my god! Yes, well I have. I mean, I've tried writing and calling. Oh my okay. gosh! He's married. She, she waited this whole time. We know that he's all right, but that's all. Will you give this letter to Michael, please, please. Mm. She, she's, she's hung up on him. She she's waiting for him. She loves him. Hello? Is Carlo there? Who's this? This is a friend of Carlo's. Would you tell him that I can't make it tonight until later? Mm hmm The food is on the table. It's getting cold. Oh yeah. Wait, so she was pregnant too? You just told me to make you dinner. Hey, Bafangu, huh? He didn't learn his lesson? I didn't even realize she was pregnant until no. 
So he's beating her when she's pregnant too. She just made dinner like he asked and then he's saying that he doesn't want it. Oh no, she set the table. It was perfect. Like that's disrespectful the way that lady called. What? What the hell? Oh, it's gonna be her again. He's beating her baby. Okay, they need to get rid of this guy. Maybe they need to break up. Now nah, go ahead, now nah, I'll kill you. You guinea brat. No, this Sonny, you need to take care of this. She was just ruining the dinner that he's told her to make and then said that oh he doesn't want it. Sonny, come on, get out of here. Go ahead, go ahead. Come on. Oh, but this is just gonna have to be a single mom because that's not working out. Maybe they and should break up then. Yeah, he and needs he's to leave the family. Be abusive as well to his children. Yeah, like what's the point? Why does he even exist in the family then? Like, oh no, it's a setup. <gasps> Sonny's oh, ended. Yeah, it's over for him. Wow, he's hard to die. He's a badass. Whoa. He was fighting. But he's just not bulletproof. Oh my gosh. It's because he was so emotional trying to get to her by himself too. They warned him, you know. My wife is crying upstairs. I think you should tell your dad what everyone seems to know. Well, They're not telling him. Me. So how does the mom know? I guess she feels it. They shot Sonny on the causeway. He's dead. They shot him? They lit him up? That heartbreak. The mom knows. Yeah, she felt it, right? They didn't tell her. No. She felt it. I want no acts of vengeance. Really? I want you to arrange a meeting with the heads of the five families. I guess he should have just done the narcotics deal. Because what? But then he wouldn't be done. Yeah. He wouldn't be I get I get, own. I get it. He's Go. no one's bitch, you know? That's true. It's so hard being a done. You have to prepare to lose your family. This is Tom Hagen, calling from Vito Corleone at his request. Now you owe your Don a service. Now he will be at your funeral parlor in one hour. This be is there. the guy that he helped? Mm -hmm. What do you want me to do? I want you to use all your powers and all your skills. I don't want his mother to see him as Oh my gosh. So that's the payment he wants? of his face in the casket, right? Look how they massacred my boy. They did. Sonny went out strong though. He was yeah. fighting. <laughs> he was really fighting. He's teaching her how to drive. Oh my gosh. He doesn't even know what happened to his brother. No. <laughs> Thursday, Wednesday? Don't show them, no. Facci di vendere subito. Subito. Will he move? Will he listen? Because his wife, her family is here. Michele, Michele, andiamo. Andiamo, dai, me l'avevi promesso. She's so cute. Ciao. Dove avrai una sorpresa, sta guidando da sola. Oh my gosh. Where is she? I fear something bad is happening. Dove vai? Michele, aspettami lì, che vengo da sola fino da te. It's a betrayal happening. Yeah, oh no. Is They're... it gonna blow? Oh no. No! No, I belong! Oh my gosh. They killed his lovely wife. Oh my gosh. He should have known. He was being too comfortable, honestly. Yeah. Was so unfortunate, so unnecessary. Her parents, her family, lost the son. They loved her. I lost the son. They're gonna feel so sad, so heartbroken. Their lovely mm -hmm. daughter, niece, is gone. A modest man, he'll always listen to reason. Yes, Don Barzini. A refusal is not the act of a friend. Don Corleone had all the judges and the politicians in New York. Then he must share them. All he loved is use them. I don't want it near schools. I don't want it sold to children. That's an infamia. In my city, we would keep the traffic in the dark, people, to call it. They're animals anyway, so let them lose their what? souls. Why did he have to say that? 
I'm really trying to yeah. be okay with these guys. But then, what? What did he? Why did he have to say that, man? Can't catch a break. Can't. <laughs> Every single movie. Yeah. But I must have strict assurance from Corleone. As time goes by and his position becomes stronger, will he attempt any individual vendetta? You talk about vengeance. He's done with vengeance. Your son back to you. Or my boy to me. Nope. On the souls of my grandchildren. That I will not be the one to break the peace we've made here today. He's trying to make peace with them. Yeah. He's not gonna do the vengeance. That's crazy. When I meet with the Tatalia people, should I insist that all these drug middlemen have clean records? But Cheney is a man who knows that without being told. But Dan is a pimp. He never could have outfought Santino. But I didn't know until this day that it was... But Cheney all along. How long have you been back? Back a year. Oh. Longer than that, I think. It's good to see you, Kate. I thought you weren't going to become a man like your father. That's what you told me. Any man who's responsible for other people. Like a senator or a president. Senators and presidents don't have men killed. Um, are you sure? Um... <laughs> who's being naive, Kate? Yeah, yeah, for real, Kate. In five years, the Corleone family is going to be completely legitimate. Wow. Michael, why did you come here? Why? He wants you back. Does she move on? I came here because I need you. Because I care for you. Please stop Why you gosh. definitely moved on? What do you mean? I'll do anything you ask. Anything to make up for what's happened to us. Mm -hmm. He only wants her back because they blew up his other wife. It's because he knows he can trust her children. and stuff. Our but he didn't even try to reach out to her. Yeah, I didn't write to her, call her, nothing. I mean, he couldn't, but still. He's saying it? He's saying that he loves her now. Oh, so she's just going with him now? Well, Michael is now head of the family, and if he gives his permission, then you have my blessing. After we make the move to Nevada, you can break off from the Corleone family and go on your own. They'll be a friend to Michael. Do as he says. Yes, he's telling you that his son is the head of the family <laughs> now. You have to listen to his son. <laughs> Make our move there, you're going to be my right hand man. Okay. Tom Hagen's no longer conciliating. He's going to be our lawyer in Vegas. And that's no reflection on Tom, but that's the way I want it. Why am I out? You're not out. You're not a wartime conciliary, Tom. Things may get rough with the move we're trying. There are reasons why you must have no part of what is going to happen. Maybe I could help. You're out, Tom. Okay, he's out. Yes. I can't get over the way your face looks. It really looks good. This doctor did some job. Hello, Mike. Welcome to Las Vegas. Is that Johnny? Anything you want, kid. Anything. Huh? Who are the girls? What about Kay? Get rid of them, Fredo. Told him to get Ooh. Oh, now get rid of them. Good. <laughs> yes, he doesn't want to see them. Hey, Hurry up, girls, leave. No, but why is he doing He's the one who brought them there. And yeah. He's like, scram. They're confused. I know, but still. <laughs> Mike, what can I do? The Corleone family is thinking of giving up all its interest in the olive oil business, settling mm -hmm. out here. Mm -hmm. Now, Mo Green will sell us his share of the casino and the hotel so it could be completely owned by the family. Mo loves the business. He never said nothing to me about selling. Well, I'll make so him an offer. He's someone to sell. We'll make him an offer and he can't refuse. That line. <laughs> you know what that means? Yeah. Convince some of your friends in the movies to do the same. This is a hard task for Johnny, but he has to do it. Okay. You're going to convince someone to sell to their business? Right. How are you, Mo? All right. You got everything you want? My credit good enough to buy you out? <laughs> He's laughing because what? Corleone family wants to buy you out. The Corleone family wants to buy me out. No, I buy you out. You don't buy me out. Okay. I do you a favor and take Freddie in when you're having a bad time, and then you try to push me out. The Coyote family don't even have that kind of muscle anymore. The yeah. Godfather is sick, right? Mo didn't mean nothing by that. Sure, he flies off the handle once in a while, yeah. but, but Mo and me were good friends, right, Mo, huh? I got a business to run. I got to kick asses sometimes to make it run right. Wow, and that guy's like, 
You didn't mean anything. What? You straightened He's my brother scared out. of Mo. He said you straightened my brother out. Think about a price. Do you know who I am? I'm Mo Green. And Mike is in charge of the family business now. Have anything to say? Say it to Michael. Yes, say it to Michael. He's in charge now. But don't ever take sides with anyone against the family again. Exactly. Ever. Yeah, he's acting, acting scared of Mo. Yeah, and he's taking the sides of Mo too. And this is a baby. Oh my god. He's not a baby. He's, yeah, no, he's bigger than a baby. Maybe he's like two he's, or three. He's a toddler. Yeah, he's right? a toddler. Connie and Carla want you to be godfather to their little boy. I spend my life trying not to be careless. I love the way he talks. <laughs> I never wanted this for you. I worked my whole life. I don't apologize to take care of my family. He didn't want Michael in the bad stuff. He didn't want Michael in this. But when it was your time that, that you would be the one to hold the strings. Senator Corleone. Senator. Governor Corleone. Something. I'm not a pet novanta. They're trying to be, be straight in the business yeah. and, you know. Now listen. Whoever comes to you with this Barzini meeting, he's a traitor. Hmm. Don't forget that. Grandpa. Yeah. Is he okay? Nope. He's so weak and tired. Is he gonna die? Maybe. He <laughs> <laughs> got so scared. scared. Him. doesn't know mm -hmm. because remember he's playing with him yeah. so he thinks he's playing dead does he notice him no maybe yeah and he's gonna tell he's them. so smart but at least he died when he was you know being happy oh. is that don barzini Barzini wants to arrange a meeting. He says we can straighten any of our problems out. You talk to him? Yeah. I can arrange security. On my territory. He told him that whoever comes to him about the meeting is a traitor. They're arranging a meeting in Brooklyn. Tessio's ground. Mm -hmm. Where I'll be safe. Is he sure? No. I always thought it would have been Clemenza, not Tessio. See, Tessio is a traitor. Tessio was always smarter. After the baptism. And then I'll meet with Don Barzini and Tatalia. All the heads of the five families. How is this going to go? What's going to happen? He's going to be, he said he's going to be godfather to Connie's. Yeah, so he's the new godfather. How is she still with that guy? Her abusive husband. What's this? Who's that guy getting ready with the gun? Mm -hmm. Baby, so cute. Michael, do you believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth? I do. Why isn't he moving? Who's that? They're planning to do something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, so cute. Look at the little hands. I can't believe we were all like that. Because then we turn into these big, non-innocent <laughs> beings. All these bad guys, they were babies too, you know? Yeah. Baby's crying. That's not a good sign. Do you renounce Satan? Wait. I do Did he set this up? Mm -hmm. Is that one of the Dons just now? One of the head of the other families? Who is this? <gasps> Whoa. Shoot. They're killing all of them. Mm -hmm. That was his plan. I do renounce them. What? <laughs> <laughs> he does not renounce shit. 
Ooh, damn, they didn't have to do that. The, those girls, yo. Even the police? Yeah. I think that's, what's his name? Barzi Barzini? Yeah, that's Don Barzini. Whoa. Michael, Ritzy, go in peace mm -hmm. and may the Lord be with you. <laughs> Oh, he's different. He's way different from his dad. Mm -hmm. Something's come up. Everybody's gonna have to leave without us. Oh, Mike, you took your vacation. Hey, Connie, please. We want to go back to the house. Wait for my call. What's he doing? Is he gonna get rid of him? What? Why would he do that? Because Corona he's abusive. I don't know. No, he's not gonna do it. <laughs> Oh, that's the guy that was to arrange the meetings. Mm -hmm. Boss says we'll come in a separate car. He says for you two to go on ahead. Hell, he can't do that. It screws up all my arrangements. Oh, well, that's wow. what he said. I can't go either, Sal. They're going to get rid of Sal? Yep. Think he knows what's up? Tell Mike it was only business. Wow. I always liked him. You oh, set wow. him up. Tom Obviously. Off the hook. Mm -hmm. How can he? For old time's sake. Nope. I can't do it, Sal. It can't be done. You tried to end end his brother. Yeah. It's the husband for real. Yeah. This is <laughs> Think it's sunny for the Barzini people. Mm hmm Yes, he's uh, the one that did it. You played with my sister. Yep. You think that could fool the Corleone? It was a setup because he was going there because of the beatings. Yes. He purposely did it so he could come. It was a setup. Yeah. He killed her brother. Her. Barzini's dead. So is Philip Tatalia. Damn. Mo Green. Stracci. Wow. Carlo, it's over for you. You need to admit it. Please say it. Be a man. He's a bastard. He needs to go. <laughs> oh, you're out of the family business. That's your yes. Question. He needs to be out of the family business. Finish, He's a traitor. I'm putting you on a plane to Vegas. Tom? So, how are they gonna stop the abuse? He won't be with his sister anymore. I want you to stay there. Okay. See, he's going to. He's sending, oh, sending him to. Las Vegas. Because it insults my intelligence. Now, who approached you? Tatalia or Barzini? He needs to come clean. Who's Barzini? I call your wife. Tell her what flight you're on. I don't trust. I don't trust Michael. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he always has something in the of his other. <laughs> Why is he saying please? Is he stupid? It's his fault. Sonny is dead. Yeah. They're gonna end him. Yep. Hello, Carlo. I mean, Sonny told him he won't make his sister a widow and his kids <laughs> orphan. <laughs> I don't know what he expected. Yeah. He did unforgivable. He yeah, that. he did he did unforgivable things. That's something Michael can do. <laughs> Look what he did to the sister. Look what he did to Sonny. Yes. Of course this guy wasn't going to leave, let him off the hook. He just wanted him to admit what he yeah. did. Look at that walk. He looks like his dad. Yeah. Yo. He's like a more modern version of his dad exactly and he's not being soft either like he's not given any chances you mess up the first time it's over she's crying Michael! Michael! yeah she loved her beating i'm kidding she didn't love it Michael, but still you what must, you killed my husband your husband you waited until you. papa died so nobody could stop you and then you killed him you blame him for Sonny. You always did. Everybody he, he did. He doesn't blame him. He did it. He's the one that did it. He killed your brother. He kept He's trash. Them all. all the time he knew he was going to kill him. And you stood godfather to our baby. Yes. You your baby is innocent. Your, it's her husband who is cold hearted. Read the papers. That's your husband. That's your husband. <laughs> I mean, she loved him. She loved him, even though he was beating her and stuff. I know. So, That's the sad part. Yeah. She lost a husband. It's like, but it's, the, it's best for you. Get a doctor. Not there and then he's yeah. telling, her, telling him to get a doctor. <laughs> he did it. This is this family is crazy. It's Who knows wild. what else Carlos would have done? Carlo. It, it's Carlo. It's not even. Carlo. It doesn't have an S on it. <laughs>
Look at his He's life. Hysterical. Oh no. He's gonna lie to her. Hysterical. Hysterical. What? <laughs> you killed her husband. He had no choice. Don't ask me about my business, Kate. Is it true? Don't ask him Don't about, ask business. Me about my business. No. And what should he what should he tell you, Kay? That he did it? You know it's true, Key. But Carlo is a very, very, very bad person. Like he's trash. He's beaten his wife and and he he's killed, been a traitor. He killed his he caused the death of his brother in law. Are you kidding me? I mean Sonny didn't even kill him. No. And he could have. He had all the resources. He had, he could have done it himself. Yeah. And you did that? No. Is she going to break up with him? I mean, if she needs to do that. Yeah. He's, He's an me. angel. Angel boy. <laughs> <laughs> he lied to her. Of course. But she she knew what she was getting into. She, he said, she like, knows this. No. <sighs> That's all you needed to do. Just say no. No. He just told her what she wanted to hear. No, I didn't do it, babe. So he's gonna keep lying to her. Of course, he's his father's son, and it's like he's worse than his dad. Yeah. Don Corleone. Don Corleone. Yes, yes, he's Don Corleone. Look at them kissing his hand. The respect. <laughs> she can't believe this. Shit. He's a demon. Hmm. Remember when that uh, was it? A priest that asked asked him if he renounced, renounced the devil. He did. He renounced them though, for real. All those devils. <laughs> He's the new devil. <laughs> He's the one. He was doing it like at the time when they were asking, yeah. all the devil devils were being renounced. Renounced, yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's insane. That was crazy. Yeah. He was being his dad, the first Don, Don Corleone. Mm -hmm. He was being, he was showing a lot of mercy. And he was, yeah. he was actually not really doing, he was doing stuff. Apparently he threatens people. He kills people, obviously all the mob stuff. Right. But he was a little bit softer. Yeah, he was. Yeah. He was a bit softer. This guy is straight savage. Maybe that's why Don, the first Don Corleone was, needed to be yeah. straight he, savage. How do you kill all the head of the fam other um, yeah. mob family members. He really like, did that, all of them. All of them, like every single one. <laughs> wow. And whoever whoever did whatever with them as well. Like, what? <laughs> That's crazy. No chances, no They had to come in. No they were trying to get rid of him, so. Yes. It's like when you, in like in, if you're not going to kill people, like in real life, right? It's like you when you cut off people, when they cross you or do yeah, something yeah. and you just, you know, you're just done with them. That's what he did, but he actually ended them. Like, it's like a fresh start. Mm -hmm. That's what he did. He's not getting out of the business. Nope. He's gonna, he's just gonna do some, it, it seems he wants to do legit, legitimate stuff, but I'm guessing he's going to force people to sell their business to yeah. him. That's what he's going to do. And then, they're gonna have the bad guys in the background if you mess with them yeah. for you and other <laughs> stuff. It's, he's never getting out of the business. And, it's, no. and he's worse than his dad, it seems. Like, sh judging from the movie, he's obviously worse, right? Yeah. And it doesn't seem that, what's his name, Clemenzo? Who? The guy that kiss, kissed him in the end and said, Don Carleone. He's not gonna move on to other shit. Remember he said he wanted he within six months he's gonna allow him to oh go on yeah own. no he's they're staying they're staying whoa so they respect him enough to actually roll with him and yeah be loyal to him like they were with his dad exactly you know that's really tough when it's really hard for that for them to respect transition yeah because he's younger they knew him when he was growing up like mm -hmm. it's hard to respect him and kiss his hand like that exactly but they have to because he did that look at what he did mm-hmm so he earned his respect, actually. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. He earned it. He earned it. He Doing called all him Don Carleone. Yeah. They were <laughs> all holding his hand, kissing it like, what? 
How do you? That's crazy. The way he lied to his wife. He's like, no, no, <laughs> no, sweetheart. No. Yeah, I'm innocent. I didn't kill Carlo. I didn't. I didn't orchestrate or order his death. <laughs> the way his sister just hugged him, though. Damn. <laughs> Did you notice? She was crying. She was hugging him and crying because he's her brother, but he did it. Like he she, did it. And he's like, she's hysterical. Hysterical. What? <laughs> <laughs> that Carlo uh, guy had to come in like, what? That was a no-no. He killed their brother. Mm -hmm. That Like, why did he... He betrayed them. And he's going to be a problem. Yeah. Like he's he he's not he's not trying to be a part of the family. Like what is he even doing? Exactly. What is he even doing? Like I don't get it. He's so easily swayed. Swayed. Like he's a child or something. Like they just gave him candy and he took it. He had it coming. Like he's a bastard. He had yeah. it coming. Like he deserved. It's well deserved. I don't even feel any way about that shit. No. I know yeah. his. I know Connie is hurting, but. Honestly, he would be ruining their kids. Mm -hmm. Their kids would be ruined, like... Yeah. At least maybe now she can find someone else to be with. It's not the end of life for her. She's still breathing. She can find someone else to, so, to fall in love with. Someone better than him, right? Yeah. To father her children, too. I guess that call about that, that woman that said she wasn't going to be able to make it or whatever... Maybe it was a whole setup so that the wife could get angry, him refusing the dinner, she could get angry, so he would beat her, and then they would call the brother to come. Something yes, like that. yes, it was, it was all, it was a setup. It was planned, so. Yes. Yeah. He set it up, and that's why he told her to cook dinner, and yeah. then said that he didn't want it for her to be crazy, and start, and then beat her for you're right yeah so that sunny could show up sunny was even savage too but he gave that guy a chance he said he was he wasn't going to you know turn his sister into um no he didn't want the children to be orphans mm -hmm. or whatever and turn his sister into a widow as well but i mean that's exactly what michael said to him and yeah, then immediately it. afterwards did it like yeah. I thought Sonny was the bad one. I thought he was a savage. But no, it's no. Michael. Sonny isn't really a savage per se. He's he, he just, was in the business he all acts along. Without being rational sometimes. Yeah, but he Michael just acts on impulse, but Michael thinks about it. Yeah. He, he thinks, knows what he's doing. Yeah, he thinks a lot and it's not it's not all just it's not all emotions, right? I no. mean he's angry but it doesn't Change, it doesn't change his um, decisions like make it too like rash, yeah. rash or like on impulse. Mm -hmm. He plans it out. It's different. Yeah, he doesn't just jump and say, "Oh, I want this to be done and this and like." He thinks Sunny. about it. He thinks about plans it and it. he plans it and it's done. Thank you so much for watching to the end, guys, and make sure you check out the full version of this reaction on our Patreon, where you'll need to line up your copy of the movie with our reactions. Make sure you smash that like button if you like The Godfather. You should. You should smash the like button, guys, yeah. if you like it. And um, comment down below how you felt throughout, like, with all the shit going down. And what you thought about Don Corleone and his... And the new Don Corleone. Yeah. It's crazy that uh, one specific scene reminded me of Scarface. But Scarface is literally after The, God the Godfather, I think. I think it came afterwards. So it's crazy how one specific scene they did kind of like the godfather in my opinion she doesn't she didn't watch scarfaces yet but she will guys i've been trying so hard to get her to watch it i literally started uh scarface once i told her you need to watch this it's crazy but she just zoned out like and then i, I, guess I, I got ready. i was like i got kind of upset i wasn't like you know extra but i was like you're not even watching and then i just watched it all by myself that time I, I don't know what I was doing. I don't remember. But <laughs> but she'll watch it, guys, soon. <laughs> That's the end of the reaction, guys. Um, virtual hug. Bye. Bye.